Welcome back. Rob Ellis is here now with the full forecast. Yeah, it's nice to see the warmer temperatures. Unfortunately, we didn't need necessarily the ice that came along with it. Some of our weather watchers echoing that sentiment as well. Let's take a look at some of the numbers. Most locations still reporting, at least from our weather watchers, below freezing, uh, but they're also reporting some of that drizzle. Let's take you far to the south where we have had some of the more significant icing uh, incidents over the last maybe six hours or so. David and Bourbon says, yeah, we're seeing a little bit of freezing rain. The temperature was nice to get those numbers warmer than they have been in almost two weeks. But the freezing drizzle was not nice, and that freezing drizzle is coming down into temperatures that looks like that look like this. We're talking near or below freezing. Oh, sure, Rensselaer, you've gotten up to 34, but I don't expect it to hold necessarily overnight. Most of these numbers are at least going to hold steady or maybe even drop a little bit as this next round of precipitation rolls in. Now, what's happening is most of this is falling as freezing drizzle, but when you look at the wider picture here, you can see that there's a lot of rain to the south. I'm hoping a lot of this changes over to snow. That's what most of our models have been indicating. Most of them say that, yeah, the temperatures are going to cool down, not only at the surface, but also in the mid levels, and that should change it over to snow, but it should get out of here pretty quickly so that by early tomorrow morning, there may still be some slick spots. I want you to be careful, but at least it will improve, and it'll really improve by the afternoon where we get sunshine and we get temperatures that are well above freezing. That's going to be some good news. 30 for our overnight low tonight. Watch for a little bit of icing out there. And then we get 36, and the forecast here really calls for temperatures to go up beyond that. Let me show you this wonderful seven day forecast. Warmest temperatures we have seen since uh, before Christmas, really around here. And you see the numbers go even warmer. Look at the almost 50 degree reading that we have on there for Thursday. It does come with some rain, but we'll take rain over the wintry mess right. that we're dealing with right now. But boy, that's a nice looking forecast.